from hunting gathering to growing food so children introduction of this chapter we have already done and now we are going to study the first unit of this chapter that's name is the earliest people why were they on the move means early human why they used to move from one place to another place right so children here we are talking about those people who used to live here on this uh, subcontinent 2 million years ago 2 million means 20 lakh years ago or we people call them hunter gatherers why do we call them hunter gatherers because those people used to do the task of hunting that's why hunter do you understand what is hunting hunting means killing some animals like a goat and like buffalo like a, any kind of deer any kind of animals which were there in the forest killing them doing the task of hunting and eating them it was a source of survival for them so this is hunting right and gathering gathering means collecting the material for food which was available in the forest areas these uh, material can be for example eggs these can be some roots some fruits some nuts seeds leaves stalks so collecting these all the items for food is known as gathering so that time people used to do the task of hunting and gathering that's why we call them hunter gatherers right so now let's come to this concept why were they on the move why they used so children because of these four reasons hunter gatherers used to move from one place to another so these four reasons are number 1 in search of food resources number 2 to chase animals to hunt number 3 in search of seasonal fruits and number 4 in search of water so because of these four resources they used to move from one place to another let's discuss these all four one by one number 1 if they stayed at one place for a long time they would have eaten up all the available plants and animals these are resources for them these are necessary for their survival so what kind of these resources these resources for example some kinds of fruits some kinds of nuts eggs some animals to hunt so these all the resources actually these are their diet necessary for their survival so staying at one place you know they would keep eating these all the things and one day they will be finished so staying at one place finished all available food plant or animal resources so that is why in search of these resources they had to move from one place to another number 2 animals move from one place to another children animal do not stay at one place because they also move from one place to another in search of their prey in search of uh, uh, grass in search of uh, green leaves they also need their food so they also keep searching their food item so to chase these animals to hunt them it was necessary for early human to follow them to uh, hunt them and to eat them so the movement of these animals made the hunter gatherers to move along with them for hunting them down this is second reason we have done animals move from place to place so it was necessary for early human to chase them or to hunt them now let's discuss third reason do you know children plants and trees bear fruits in different seasons if they need to eat mango they need to go to a different place if they need to eat banana they need to go to different place if they need to eat 
apple then they had to move to different place so children different variety of trees they bear different kind of fruits at different places in different times in different season so if they need to eat these fruits they had to move from one place to another this is third reason now let's come to fourth point so people plant and animals all need water to survive we cannot survive without water so in search of water bodies early human used to move from one place to another water is found in water bodies like lakes streams and rivers while many rivers and lakes are perennial perennial means they are having water in them throughout the year but some water bodies become dry during dry seasons during winter and summer so people living on their banks would have had to go in search of water during dry seasons so in search of water early human had to move from one place to another children there were four reason responsible for the movement of early human from one place to another number 1 they used to move from one place to another in search of food resources number 2 to chase animals to hunt number 3 to eat some seasonal fruits and number 4 they used to move from one place to another in search of water so here we have done this unit next part is how do we know about these people so this part of this chapter we will study in the next video